hello everyone so today we will learn how to <coughs> analyze or find the degree of statical indeterminacy for a truss or a simple pin jointed frame so we know the general formula of ds the very general formula as we have discussed in the previous video is ds equals to total number of total number of unknown minus total number of equations of equilibrium so this is the general formula of ds degree of statical indeterminacy by this general formula we can derive ds for truss we can also derive ds for frame and for beam so let's look about the truss so here i will take a very simple example very simple example of a truss so you see now we need to understand the number of unknowns unknowns means the things we need to find in the structure in truss element we have to find member forces member forces and reaction so in truss if you take a member if one member is isolated then each member will have one axial force okay so the axial force it may be compression in nature or tensile in nature so each member will have one internal force each member so i can take total number of total number of unknown in case of truss equals to m means number of member number of member will be equals to number of internal forces because each member will have one internal force one axial force plus r reaction we also have to find the reaction reactions are also unknown so r means number of reactions so in case of truss total number of unknown is m plus r where m is number of members and r is number of reaction okay now we need to understand total number of equations of equilibrium in truss element in case of method of joints in case of method of joints you are using summation of f of x and summation of f of y we are not using summation of m okay so in case of truss element each joint has got two equations of equilibrium each joint summation of f of x and summation of f of y so you go to each joint you can use summation of f of x and summation of f of y and you can solve the the problem so here i will uh, i will write here total number of equations equations equals to each joint has got two equations so now i can write the formula i can formulate the formula here ds equals to total number of unknown which is m plus r and total number of equations of equilibrium which will be minus 2j where m is number of members r is number of reaction j is number of joint in this case in this problem there are three members okay and uh, number of reaction are three two here one here and number of joints are three so here we have to solve this problem we have to find ds of this structure and we have just derived the formula ds equals to m plus r minus 2j where m is number of members 
or number of reaction j number of joint so what you have to do here you have to just count the members the reactions and the joint and you can solve for ds here you have to count for the members so member here are six six members number of reaction this is hinge support and this is roller support r will be equals to 3 okay and joints 1 2 3 4 four joints are four now you can solve for ds ds will be 1 you can use this formula you substitute this value in this equation you will get ds equals to 1 for this problem here number of members are four joints are also four reactions are three here two and this is roller support one ds will be for this structure ds will be minus one when you get minus it means that the structure is unstable okay i i have discussed the stability of the structure in the previous video you can see that here number of members m equals to number of members 8 you can count it joints are 5 in number 1 2 3 4 5 the reactions are 3 ds for this structure will be if you calculate you will get 1 okay similarly for this structure here number of members are 13 reactions are 5 2 1 2 total reactions are fine number number of joints are 8 so degree of statical indeterminacy for this structure will be 2 we can use this formula just have to substitute the values now we will see how to derive formula for rigid jointed frame we have to go back to the general formula of ds ds equals to total number of unknown minus total number of equations of equilibrium total number of unknown unknown will be in terms of internal forces plus reactions the load will be given and what you have to find you have to find the reactions and the internal forces developed in the member what you have to find is unknown okay now with regards to internal forces in case of rigid jointed frame if you cut a member any member if you cut any member you are likely to get one axial force one moment and one shear force anywhere you make a cut you are likely to get three internal forces one moment one axial force and one shear force so each member here each member is having three internal forces okay so total number of unknown i will write 3m why 3m because each member is having three internal forces okay and plus reaction reactions are also unknown because we are required to find the reactions of the structure so total number of unknown in case of rigid jointed frame is 3m plus r now we have to go to define the total number of equations of equilibrium if you go to any joint any joint to analyze the structure you are using summation of f of x summation of f of y and moment okay so each joint has got three equations of equilibrium so total number of equations of equilibrium is 3j where j is number of joint so i will write here ds equals to 3m plus r 
माइनस थ्री जे इन केस ऑफ हाइब्रिड स्ट्रक्चर हाइब्रिड स्ट्रक्चर मीन्स इन फ्रेम सम जॉइंट्स विल हैव इंटरनल हिंच ओके सो इफ द जॉइंट्स सम जॉइंट्स आर हैविंग इंटरनल हिंजेस सो दैट टाइप ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर वी मे कॉल इट एज हाइब्रिड स्ट्रक्चर सो वेन यू आर फाइंडिंग डी एस ऑफ ए हाइब्रिड स्ट्रक्चर वी हैव टू यूज दिस इक्वेशन प्लस विथ सम एडिशन ओके थ्री एम प्लस आर माइनस थ्री जे प्लस अल्फा वेर एम इज अ नंबर ऑफ मेंबर आर नंबर ऑफ रिएक्शन जे नंबर ऑफ जॉइंट एंड अल्फा आई हैव डिफाइंड हियर अल्फा इक्वल्स टू समेशन ऑफ इन ब्रैकेट एम डैश माइनस वन वेर एम इज नंबर ऑफ मेंबर्स कनेक्टेड टू द इंटरनल हिंजेस फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू सी दिस एग्जाम्पल एम डैश फॉर दिस एग्जाम्पल इट विल बी टू बिकॉज टू मेंबर्स आर कनेक्टेड टू इंटरनल हिंजेस सो अल्फा आई विल जस्ट find a ds for this the number of member here will it will here it is 3 into 3 plus number of reactions here the number of reactions are 3 in number here also it is 3 total number of reactions are 6 minus number of joints 1 2 3 4 3 4 into 4 plus alpha for this problem alpha will be alpha equals to m dash number of members connected to internal hinges two members are connected to internal hinges 2 minus 1 it will be 1 plus 1 so ds you will get here ds for this structure is 2 here you see we have two internal hinges in the frame so i told you this type of structure is called as hybrid structure to find ds we have to use this formula here how to find alpha you know how you can you can count the number of members the number of reactions the number of joint number of members are 5 reactions are 9 3 plus 3 plus 3 number of joints are 6 in number now we have to see how we can find alpha alpha is alpha is summation of m dash minus 1 okay so here you see first internal hinge this this internal hinge has got three member or three member are connected to this internal hinge so first we have to consider this internal hinge it is 3 minus 1 3 members are connected to this internal hinge so m dash for this will be 3 3 minus 1 plus we also have one more internal hinge here one more internal hinge so two members are connected to this internal hinge plus 2 minus 1 so alpha will be 2 Plus one, it will be three. Now you can solve ds equals to three into five plus nine minus three into six plus three. After solving, you will get ds equals to three. 